Henry David Thoreau was a 19th century writer, philosopher, and essayist. He became an icon of pacifism, nonviolence, and freedom for all time. Henry Thoreau lived in Concord, Massachusetts, the epicenter of the transcendental movement. He was a contemporary of Ralph Waldo Emerson and became the living embodiment of the transcendentalist views of idealism, self-reliance, and belief in the universal mind, a power that lives in all of us and allows us to transcend our own limitations. Henry took his view of transcendentalism to the extreme by withdrawing from society and in 1846 he built a cabin for himself on the bank of Walden Pond in order to live simply with nature. In July of 1846, Thoreau's peaceful existence was threatened when he was arrested for not paying his poll taxes to protest the Mexican War, a war he believed to be unjust and begun by the government's selfish interests. The product of his experience in jail was the essay Civil Disobedience, a radical call for change in an unjust world. Thoreau's words and actions inspired generations of thinkers in the 1960s and 70s, troubled times when America's involvement in the Vietnam War caused unrest and dissension that paralleled the America of Thoreau's day. In addition, young people were desperately trying to make sense of life. People turned to Thoreau for answers, especially in his essay, Civil Disobedience. It is this essay that most of the night Thoreau spent in jail is based on. It sums up his nonviolent protest to an unjust government and an unjust time which is still relevant today.